One of the tabletops I was actually introduced to, uh, Kevin Bowman, I think, put it on LinkedIn, um, was saying, you know, let's say you have a third party that has recall enabled Windows machines, because that's coming out, I think, uh, in the fall or something, Microsoft is essentially turning on recall, uh, which is an AI based tool that um, listens in on an API. It's basically a video API that's on like your local interface. So it's not something anybody can just, you know, be on the networks, you know, contact and and get it. It has to be on the one two seven loop back. Um, but anyway, it goes and views that video feed that is literally your 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 laptop, what it's generating on the screen, and it's scraping that and it's pulling in data. Well, okay, you as company, you have your machines. There may be not co-pilot enabled machines yet because they don't have that you know, neuro chip in it yet but you have a third party msp that does and they help you manage your databases or they help you manage your your application or whatever portal and maybe you've got sensitive data personal data of your customers or if your health patient data it could be it could be legal data maybe you're going to break curt attorney client privilege but they've got those neuro chips Recall gets turned on, and all of a sudden, on their Citrix or VDI or their RDP sessions they have in your environment, that data is all getting captured <laughs> on that and getting cataloged on those machines. Okay, how do you? What do you do? How? how you know hmm. that comp that computer gets compromised. What do you do? Yeah, as a CISO, that feature is terrifying. 